royalties it's queen welcome back to my youtube channel or if this is your first time welcome to my youtube channel and subscribe if you haven't because on here we talk about some good stuff and you will want to be a part of this channel because i keep it real and i give a lot of tips and hacks and you know just a lot of, like you will want to be a part of this gang let's get let's be a part of the royalty gang okay um yeah so on my channel today we're gonna be talking about um five turnoffs and turn ons which have to do with sex um yeah so basically on instagram i asked 10 men and 10 women um what are their five um sex turn ons and turn offs and basically everybody but one got back to me with that and yeah so in this video i guess i'm gonna do the turn offs because if i try to put all of it in one video i feel like it's going to be way too long and i don't want like a 20 minute video so i'm going to do the turn offs the five turn offs and five the five turn off for men and women um in this video um yeah i'm kind of pause so basically i just recorded this whole thing i recorded the whole thing and i thought i was recording i guess i never pushed the record button so it didn't record anything so i'm doing this all over again but anyways let's jump into it so how i did it was the 10 guys and 10 female i asked which were different ages different race you know just there was all different none of them were like you know i didn't pick them just because they're my friends i literally just picked 10 different kinds of people some that i think were shy some that i think were like you know very spontaneous i just try to pick the 10 most different people i could find on my ig and basically i wrote down let's say for men like when men gave me their five turnoffs i would write down each five for every guy that sent you know sent me their turnoffs and whichever one that had kind of the same answers or same response i will put a tally by it and whichever five had the most tallies that's the five i um picked so and that's the same with women too so this may not be you know the case for men or women like y'all may have different turn-ons or different turn-offs like this is just basically from the people i picked and yeah so i'm going to start with men and like I said, I'm just doing the turn offs for this video. So if you want to see the turn ons, stay tuned for the next video. So for the men, the first turn off for men is bad hygiene, ladies. Like, I can't even believe that was one of them. I guess men ran into some women who don't have good hygiene, but don't have bad hygiene. I mean, not even for sex, for yourself. Like, you know, you're a woman, you're supposed to keep yourself clean. But I guess basically they want a woman who smells good, a woman um, who's shaved, like under her armpits, her legs are shaved, um, not necessarily her, her cat has to be shaved because some men like it and some men don't. But make sure your legs and armpits are shaved. And like, and I know a guy, there's like some responses that kind of fall in the category of bad hygiene. So I kind of combined them. Um, like a guy said he hates when a woman is like rough, like her hands is rough, her feet is rough. I mean, which is disgusting. Like, unless she's like a construction worker or something like women, your hands and feet should not be rough. That's not cute. And it doesn't feel good. So make sure, you know, you take care of that. You keep yourself up. Make sure... You know, you smell good. Make sure you clean your area. Don't be smelling like fish. Don't be smelling like sweat. Like, don't be smelling like none of that crazy stuff. Make sure you clean it. Um, carry baby wipes with you if you have to. Just make sure you smell good and you feel good and you look good. Just keep your hygiene up. And then brush your teeth. I know some women that be having some stink, <laughs> some really stinky breath. Um, so brush your teeth too. Okay, so... All right, so number two for guys that's a turn off is when a woman's limited. Um, I guess by that, he means like, um, some of these were hard for me to think of like scenarios because I'm like limited. But anyways, I guess by limited, the guys mean like 
they only want to do it in one place like they want to just stick to the bedroom or something or they only want to stick to like one position they don't want to try anything like you know maybe a girl don't want to try anal or maybe a girl don't want to you know try giving him head or something like that or they could mean like limited as far as like location like maybe the girl like i said want to stick to the bedroom instead of in the kitchen in the shower in the car behind a building you know at a park so um women just just you know be spontaneous don't be so limited try things i mean if you don't like it tell him up front and then let him decide if he want to continue pursuing you or not um but yeah just don't be limited limited is boring don't be boring like come on women um yeah so that brings me to number three which is kind of like number two um basically they said lazy they don't like when a woman's lazy and i guess that means like um she doesn't like doing anything i don't know it's kind of like how can a woman be lazy but i guess they mean like if they just lay there like if the woman is literally just laying there not doing anything like she doesn't want to get up and ride or like you know just lazy so women don't be lazy get active if you don't even know if you don't know what to do then you know go to youtube and see like what you can do to spice things up and that brings me to number four and guys said they hate when women are too aggressive which is funny because i'm like too aggressive like like too aggressive like what do you do that's too aggressive and then i just really had to think about it and i guess like like in my mind in my mind i picture like a woman sliding a guy off the bed or <laughs> i don't know or like like flipping him over so she can ride or something but just too like rough i guess i have no idea but women do not be too aggressive like don't be trying to choke your man out like don't scratch him too hard like to where he's like bleeding or something just you know be rough but just don't be too rough i guess i don't know i hope i hope i answer that correctly for the men um okay so number five for men is a woman who don't know what she's doing and that kind of goes into like a woman who's like lazy I feel like um, but yeah if you don't know what you're doing like I said go to um, any porn site and just look at how those women do things um, if you don't know how to ride just look at videos if you don't know how to give head just look at videos like if you don't know how to do any of those things or if you don't know how to like tease your man just you know just look at videos there's a million and one videos online. I'm not having I'm playing I don't have any videos online but there's a million and one videos online just look at them so you know what you're doing you know or just have confidence confidence is key sometimes when you don't have confidence and you're nervous you kind of don't know what you're doing in a sense but I don't know but men say that's a turn off so women get it together you better know what you're doing and you better get on your game all right so that was the five for men so for women da, 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 da. okay so the five turn off for women are number one no rhythm men y'all have to have rhythm <laughs> i don't even know how to explain it um basically <laughs> i don't know i don't know um it's like hard to explain like it's just you know i don't like how do you not have rhythm it's like i don't even know how to explain it but guys just please have rhythm um don't be stroking slow for like five strokes speed up for like five strokes slow like or like just don't be going all crazy you know just keep it constant until she's about to finish or something like know how to stroke know what position is good um position is key if you're not in the right position of course your rhythm is going to be off because clearly you don't know what you're doing but guys please just have rhythm um i don't know how you can practice maybe for pillow maybe for stuffed animal but please just have rhythm okay so number two for women which is crazy because i didn't think that i didn't even think of this one but i guess women um don't like when y'all are quiet so men i'm gonna need y'all to pipe up a little bit 
Um, I never notice if a guy's quiet or not, because I'm usually the loud one, so I can never really hear if he's making any noise. But I guess for women who are not as loud as me, they want to hear their men, you know, I guess. <laughs> they want to hear their men making some type of noise. Like, if you're stroking and you're just like... You know, you're not you're not saying nothing or breathing or something. Like just just make some noise. Be like, oh dang, or oh my god, or this feels so good, or something like that. Like I don't want to curse, so I can't say that some of the phrases that y'all can say. Like, oh f. <laughs> um, yeah. So guys, start speaking. Um, moan. Do a little bit of do a little bit of that. Girls want to hear you, so speak up. Okay, so number three is bad hygiene, which should have been number one, ladies. I am disappointed in you. I am disappointed. Bad hygiene should have been number one. But um, as far as like being musty, um, guys, y'all are musty probably 99.9% .9 of the time, whether it's your armpits, whether it's your balls, whether it's just anything on you, it's musty and it stinks. Um, yeah, so take a shower. I know y'all like to skip a couple days or, you know, whatever y'all do, just make sure you smell, just take a shower, just take a shower. Um, we don't want to smell your feet. We don't want to smell corn chips. We don't want to smell your breath after you just smoked and it smells like dookie. Um, we don't want to smell your dirty hair that smells like old grease. We don't want to smell your balls, leftover pee. We don't want to smell none of that. None of it. We don't want to smell it. Um, get in the shower, clean up, smell good. Thank you. Um, so that brings me to, okay, so that brings me to number four. And <laughs> women say they don't like when men come too quick. Yeah. I don't know about y'all, but I love when the guy I'm messing with comes quick because it lets me know that mine is good, my thing, like, it lets me know my cat is bomb, that he can't control himself, that, uh, well, it doesn't matter. For <laughs> but women do not like when a guy nuts quick. So, I don't know what to say. Um, don't. <laughs> I guess think about something that's, not gonna make you nut quick but then again that might get you soft so i don't know i don't know about that one i wouldn't have picked that one for my top five because i like when a guy nuts quick but hey um and then that brings me to number five women do not like a one round guy nope and i can vouch for that one i understand like if you nut quick um it brings me back to number four because that kind of tied in if you nut quick and then, you know, you keep going rounds and rounds. Like, you can go, like, ten rounds. That's fine. But if you can only last one round and you not quit, like, adios. Like, that's a done deal. Like, we're not getting any pleasure. You just got off and we just got started. Like, that's that's not that's not it. Um, yeah. Um, or if you give, like, one long round or if you, like... I don't know. You just gotta, you just gotta know, like, if you can last, if you're one of the guys who can last a long time, I don't need the first round to be 10 minutes. I really don't. Like, I need a break. <laughs> um, I don't know. I need you to net for me. I need you to let me know that my stuff is good. Um, yeah, but we don't like when y'all last one round, so try to go more rounds if you got to take a break in between you know then take a break but yeah we don't like when y'all go on round and then can't get hard again so that's <laughs> that's the five um turn offs that got the most tallies from men and women um like i said this may not be yours um, top five because some of these were not my top five but majority of the people said this so it just you know opens your mind a little bit but for both men and women um just please make sure your hygiene's good um that should have been number one on both lists bad hygiene is an automatic like no for me um i know a lot of men complain and be like 
I guess this goes into the men's category when they're like men, women are lazy or something like that or I, I don't know anyways um if you have bad hygiene I'm not gonna want to have sex with you like it doesn't turn me on you can do stuff to try to turn me on but if I smell something or if you taste some type of way like that's gonna turn me off and that's gonna dry me out like I, my coochie ain't gonna go whoop whoop like <laughs> like please just have a good hygiene and women that like I said that should be priority like y'all should have good hygiene regardless you're a woman take care of your area smell good look good feel good learn your job okay so that's the end of my video for the well that's the end of my topic for these fives um i'm about to film the next video like right now as soon as i'm done with this one and these are going to be the turn ons for the five turn ons for men and women and if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you had something different than what i listed for men and women comment down below and then maybe i can make a second you know video or maybe i can do some if you have a different idea of what you want me to do i can do that too just comment down below list whatever you have in mind down below um i remember one guy said he didn't feel comfortable commenting on my post so he just sent me like a dm if you don't want to comment on this channel that's fine send me a dm let me know what you want me to talk about let me know you know you don't have to just talk to, i say comment down below on here because it's easier for me to read everybody's all at one time but if you don't feel comfortable just go to my dm on instagram and just you know message me let me know um yeah but if you like this video please give it a thumbs up um if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe i know only 40 46 percent um of people who watch my videos are subscribed and then the other like another 40 something percent are not subscribed and like a 13 percent says like or not 13 percent but like a certain percentage says um it says something i don't even know but basically if you're not subscribed please subscribe to my channel because i'm a dope girl and yeah why wouldn't you so stay tuned and my next video is gonna be even better than this one bye